brought him with me. The first night that I got here and worked at the escort services, he beat me down to a pulp and told me to break myself and said he was a pimp, said, I'm, a, I'm, I'm your pimp now. You better listen to me. And if you don't listen to me, I'll kill you now. Now, mind you, a, a smart person, right? A, a woman, she's, at this point, I'm 19. I'm like, well, hold up, hold up, wait a second. No, you're not my pimp. Boom, another, another hit in the face. Shut up, you know, and you can fill in all the blanks with every bad swear word you can imagine. Sure. He was screaming at me at the top of his lungs. And I, I swear to you, his eyes were black. It was literally like there was a demon controlling him. Now he has a geome too. His mother abused him as a child. Really bad, by the way. Used to beat him. So do you think he had a vendetta against women? Mm -hmm. Yes, probably at the time he did. Did he have complex trauma? Absolutely. His daddy took off when he was three or four years old. Never came back. Was an alcoholic and a gambler. Mm -hmm. He, I mean, I'm telling you. And then when I left him finally, after he almost killed me many times, by the way, put me in trunks, was going to dig a grave for me, beat me in front of six other pimps. I ended up going with another guy that was just as abusive, another pimp. Except he was a prettier pimp because he didn't have other girls I had to share him with that I knew about anyway. And so this guy abused me for another five years. So 10 years, a decade goes by of my life. And John, I had made millions of dollars at this point. Like I averaged, and back then you can double the amount because I averaged between 2,000 on a bad night, and this was in the 80s, so double that amount to 4,000. 2,000 to $5,000 a night in money, I averaged. Wow. Gave it all back to the pimps. 